Disney. It's a small world. I love school. It's Monday morning. Time to go to school. In the United States, Andrew takes the school bus. In China, Ling's father walks her to school on his way to work. In Italy, Dario rides his bicycle to school. He's looking forward to seeing his friends. In South Africa, Zanele's mother and father kiss her goodbye for the day. At Dario's school, the students are learning to tell time. The clock has an hour hand and a minute hand. Who knows what time it is, the teacher asks. Dario raises his hand. It's nine o'clock, he says. It's time for music class at Zanele's school. The students are learning to play African drums. Bom. Bom, bom. Zanele loves the deep sound of her drum. Andrew's class is learning to read. B, E, E. Andrew reads each letter in a word. What does that spell? The teacher asks. B, the students all shout together. China is a very old country, Ling's teacher says. Her class is studying Chinese history. One thousand years ago, China was ruled by an emperor. Ling has a picture of him. She thinks his hat makes him look very wise. Soon, it's lunchtime. In Italy, Dario and his friends eat pasta with tomato sauce. In South Africa, Zanele eats corn porridge and vegetable stew. Andrew and his classmates in the United States eat turkey sandwiches. In China, Ling eats rice with vegetables and tofu. At recess, Ling and her classmates play Catch the Dragon's Tail. They line up. Ling is at the front. She is the dragon's head. Can she tag the tail while everyone stays in line? Math is Zanele's favourite subject. She uses seashells to practice addition. The class collected the shells on a trip to the seashore. Two plus three is five, says Zanele. Three plus two is five, says Zanele's friend. You're both right, says the teacher. In the afternoon, Dario and his friends have gym class. They choose teams for soccer. In Italy, they call it calcio. They try to see who will get a goal first. Zanele draws a lion in art class. Her friend draws a giraffe. They use crayons on smooth white paper. Zanele imagines her lion chasing the giraffe. She draws lines behind the lion. Now it looks like it's running. Andrew's class has a pet. His name is Fernando, and he is a turtle. Fernando hatched from an egg, Andrew's friend Katie says, just before the bell rings. The class is studying animals. They learn that turtles lay eggs just like chickens. At the end of the day, it's time to go home. But tomorrow, 
everyone will be back for another fun day at school. Disney. It's a small world. I love school.